What's up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Chloe Doletsky and in today's video we are talking all about how to set and actually reach your goals. One, two, three, let's switch this up. it is already the end of 2021 what a crazy year it has been i became a mom i started a business so many good things came from this year but i don't know about you guys 2022 is truly the year we are going to up level it is a level up season baby I just feel in my heart, I know in my soul that 2022 is going to be the best year of my life. Speaking of up-leveling our life, I am officially taking clients. I am a personal trainer and an online health and wellness coach. If you are somebody who is ready to up-level your life, you are ready to jump and go all in on your health and fitness journey, Uplevel You is a health and wellness program designed by me to help you level up your life and establish true self-love and confidence on a mind, body, and soul level. I want to help you reach your health and fitness goals while still enjoying all the things that you love. This is for you if you have fitness goals but you don't know where to start or you lack motivation and accountability. This program is for you if you want to learn how to establish and maintain healthy habits in a healthy, balanced lifestyle. It is so possible to enjoy your life while still hitting and reaching all of your goals and I am here to show you that and to teach you how. We'll teach you what and how to eat to properly fuel your body for your specific goals. This program includes not only fitness and nutrition coaching, but also we heavily focus on mindset because I truly feel that even if you're focused on your fitness, you're focused on your nutrition, if you're not focused on your mindset and really gaining a strong mental perspective and mindset shift, if you're not working to better yourself in that area, your life is not going to be what it can be and what it should be because you deserve to feel and look your absolute best on all levels oh my gosh he's going in the background period but with that being said if this is something you're interested in i will leave the link to apply for one-on-one -on -one coaching below i am so passionate about helping women become their best selves and live their best lives also if you can hear isco in the background he is in the room he's just eating a snack in his playpen so i'm going to try to film this video if he will let me so that is my life we're keeping it real authentic and honest over here with that being said as we approach the new year it comes time for the new year resolutions. These big, huge goals that we say new year, new me, which is amazing if you actually plan to stick to that. But I find what happens in a lot of cases is people set these really, really big goals for themselves, these really big resolutions, and after about two weeks, they get burnt out and they drift off and don't seem to follow through because their goals were not set in a proper way way their goals are not set with technique and their goals were not attainable for them or their life in this video i'm going to teach you how to set and actually achieve all of your goals for 2022. first things first i want you to get really really clear on what it is you want to see happen this year what you want to come from the year 2022. i want you to envision and know what and who you want to become. What is your main focus this year? What is your vision? What do you want to see happen? Who do you want to see yourself as? Think about it like by January of 2023, where do you want to see yourself? Where do you want your life to be this time next year? When we're setting these goals, I want you to remember to think about what is going to make your heart happy, what is going to be fulfilling in your soul, and what is going to nurture you on a level that you actually genuinely crave and desire. So after we get really, really clear on what it is we want to see happen this year, I want you to break down your life or your goals into categories for me I wrote down specific business goals and wrote out an entire business plan for 2022 broken down into quarters that's a whole separate thing that I'm not gonna get too deep into 
But then for my personal goals, I broke them down into categories such as mental goals, physical, nutrition, financial, as well as education or other. After you've broken down your categories into goals, in each section, write down your goals for each category. And when we're writing down these goals, I want you to note that you want to be creating SMART goals. This means specific, measurable, attainable, realistic, and time-bound. And be real with yourself. You know what you are capable of. You know what you can achieve. You want to write down goals that are attainable to you and realistic for your lifestyle. You don't want to write down goals that are like so far-fetched that you know subconsciously you probably won't reach them, but you want to re write them down anyways. That's great if you want to write down like a long-term goal. But for this year, keep it time-bound and it's very specific for what you want and when you want to accomplish it by. Like I said, you know what you're capable of and as you are capable of anything your heart and mind desires, be realistic, know that in a timely fashion things do come. So once we write down some goals, I want you to next think what do you need to do in order to make these goals happen? What is your plan behind each goal? For example, you wanna wake up earlier, that's great. In order to wake up earlier, what do you have to do the day prior? Are you going to go to bed earlier? Are you going to put your phone away by 8 p.m. so you're not distracted and your brain isn't constantly in motion because you're scrolling on social media? What do you need to do? Another example, you want to lose 20 pounds. Okay, awesome, totally doable, but what are you going to do to lose that 20 pounds? Do you have a specific plan in place, a specific nutrition plan that you're going to follow in order to reach that goal? Do you have a specific program? Do you have a coach? What do you need to do in order to get to where you wanna be? So another thing I wanna talk about is in three months, four months, I'm almost done baby, okay? So now I want you to think three or four months in to the year. Once it comes, like three months, once it's March, we want to reevaluate and reassess. So, where are you at? Have you been consistent? Where are you at? What are you feeling? How are you doing getting yourself to where you want to be? Are you staying on track? Are you following your plan? Are you not? I want you to think and assess whether or not the goals you set were actually truly attainable for you and your lifestyle. And if they're not, that's totally okay. Sometimes we set goals not thinking about the random things in life that could happen or something comes up we aren't able to be as consistent as we want and that's fine you know that that, that happens life happens and it's totally okay we just have to come back evaluate and reassess and once you get to that point maybe you need to lower your expectation on yourself maybe you're holding yourself a little bit too high in a short period of time that's okay i'm here to tell you that it is okay give yourself some grace you will get to where you want to be with time hard work and consistency and nobody can tell you that you won't but if you're setting goals that are too large for a small period of time, it's really easy to get caught up in feeling like a failure and feeling like we're not accomplishing anything when we don't reach our goals in the specific time period that we set them in. But it's okay, just remember life happens, you're not a failure. Just keep working hard and keep striving to get to where you wanna be and you will get there eventually. Remember that you are so powerful, your mind is powerful and you can do absolutely anything you set your mind to. Like I said before, with time, patience and hard work, you absolutely can do anything. You are so worthy of achieving all that you desire. You are so capable and you can truly do anything. So with that being said, a couple tips that I have are to stay organized, write things down. I'm a paper person, have a journal, get organized, write it on a whiteboard, write it in your notes on your phone, put it in front of you. Number two, create a vision board. Whether you do this on Pinterest and set it as the background on your phone, do something that allows you to keep in mind your goals for the year. It'll help keep you accountable to understand and know why you're doing what you're doing. 
Third thing, with that being said, know your why. You want to have a really deep why behind what you want to achieve. If you don't have a why, what is the point of doing anything truly? You want to always remember your why. Your why, you could put it in your vision board as well or just remind yourself of it often. Have it somewhere that you can read it back. I think with that being said, that is going to conclude this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful. If you like these kind of videos, then definitely let me know in the comments below. Click the like button, subscribe. I have a goal to be consistent on YouTube this year. I know I say it every year, but this video literally took me 10 minutes to sit down and film. And I just have no excuse why I'm not filming videos. I have so much value to give. I hope you guys again enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.